वेलकम बैक दिस इज पार्टिकल काउंटर पार्ट टू ऑफ थ्री Hey guys, if you have not subscribed our channel, please subscribe and click on the bell icon. After showing you the unboxing of Particle Counter and its related accessories, I would like to show you the device function with its specific keys. Here I am pressing the on and off key, and two to three seconds uh, it works, and the device is on. And here you can see the time and date is already. um adjusted and set and it already charged but i want to uh, show you the functional keys like f1 f2 f3 so f1 is um, actually the memory set in which you can see the picture video and particle log so i am pressing the enter key and here are the pictures of some locations where i have taken uh, the particle count There is a problem with this device that uh, hence it's a video particle counter, but uh, we have to take picture, so uh, the area would be identified. Otherwise, you have to do the rapidly work uh, with your device, like store the data uh, in your computer where software is already installed. These are my last logs where I have taken uh, the particles. It's a data of my particle count, but you can see uh, in your PC when you use this USB device. In PC, it shows results as per time and date. I have exited now from the F1 key. Now F2 is uh, for the system setting in which you can select the date, time, font, color, language. etc here you can select the font color as well like blue white green gold whatever you like it's just a function a general function key and uh, yes it's not uh, our purpose that language is uh, maybe a useful thing but uh, in asia we must use english because we don't know any other language and the other one is the brightness where we use the display brightness like it's uh, um, 100% and the brightness is right now is 100% and uh, here is a order power of means uh, we have to decide where if you are not working with the particle counter so it will be off by itself it's up to us we decide we disable it or select 3 minutes 15 minutes or 60 minutes i am going out and this is uh, display time out and this one is alarm it's enable alarm means it will show uh, the it will give the tone if it's anything happen like if the result goes out of limit then it gives some alarm the another one is the memory status So here is a memory status where we choose the device or the SD card. Yes, this particle counter has also the SD card option, and because it's also taking some pictures and videos, so yes, it requires data, a pro proper GB data to store pictures, video, and our particle count. and here is a factory setting that means if uh, we do yes so our all data will be removed the it's a unit option for the temperature like if you want to have in celsius or fahrenheit it's up to us i select it uh, on celsius Okay now I am escaping from here and the third key is F3 in which there is a description related to this device 
F3 shows the functions and also related to the keys like the color LCD display and the up and down button and also the escape button and uh, enter button etc. If I want to change the page I will again press the F3 key and here is a model detail that is VPC 300. It shows the description related to what is the particle count test and why we are using this device. Are some limits by the counter that uh, and also it is also related with some WHO guidelines and the, here are some sizes like channels uh, and it's also depend on us that what channel we have decided but follow your SOPs and the WHO or USB guidelines because it may vary now I want to do uh, or run some particle count test but I will share in my next video as per my SOP that I prepared so far and also share with you its user guide